What's good, YouTube? This your man, Spill Dog. You know, man, in a lot of ways, I'm, I'm real glad to see Derrick James, you know, uh, land on his feet. You know, he still got good fighters. <coughs> and he's still going to be able to uh, make good money in the sport. But, boy, uh, coming off, I mean, what did he say? He got fighter of the year. I mean, trainer of the year last year, or year before last. He lost him two fights with uh, the fight with, against Crawford and the fight against Canelo, Canel which... You know, those those respectable losses. Now you gotta come back against Devin Haney and Javante Davis. Shit, man, that's gonna be damn near four losses in a row. I hate to say it. Uh now I think <clears throat> out of out of all of them, I don't you know, it's hard to say. I I, I I think I think Ryan Garcia got a better chance fighting Devin than uh Frank do against Tank. You know, Ryan real fast, you know, uh a lot of guys say it was a long time ago and they fought. That don't matter. They fought six times. You know, uh, yeah, they've learned some things, but I don't even know. If, if you ever played sports, you know, I've seen it with professionals. I've seen it with kids that I coached uh, basketball that made it to the NBA and certain moves and certain stuff people been doing, like, that's good at it. Uh, they've been doing that since they was... 11, 12, 13 years old, a lot of them, uh, <clears throat> they still been fighting against the same level of competition, just at different ages. And it's going to be a lot that, as they get to the fight, that I think they're going to remember about one another. Uh, you know, not enough t to that where you can just look for it, but there's going to be some things that everybody do because they're just comfortable with it, and that's how they learn to uh, it, it's going to be some stuff you learned in the very beginning. You're going to take with you to the very end, just like Floyd fighting with his shoulder like he do. Uh, just different stuff. But Derrick James got his hands full. <clears throat> now, <clears throat> what I will say, I think I said it on another video uh, yesterday. Derrick James, I don't know what it is about him. All the guys that I've seen him train outside of Earl, once they come get with him, they start punching harder and knocking fighters out. That's been consistent in his uh since I've been watching him as a trainer. He got a lot to prove now. Uh, from what they're saying, he the one kicked the girl out the gym. So he got a lot to prove. I mean, and you know, just like you know, everybody gave you props for getting uh trainer of the year, but uh you got to keep going. And now you done picked up these other fighters. You got to show that you can do the same thing with them that you deal with Earl Spence because Ryan Garcia is a world-class level fighter. I, I, I really don't get the hate that the boy get now. He, he, a, he a good fighter. He only lost a tank. I mean, you know, uh, <clears throat> and when a guy is that good, you get the right man with him, anything can happen, especially when he got a money punch. That left hook, you know, <clears throat> Devin is a good boxer, but he don't have no money punch. Uh, tank, his, his left hook and his uppercuts, you know, uh, Crawford, that right hand, that, that right jab, and his uppercuts. You know, most of the marquee fighters, they got a, they got, they got a, especially the ones that's knocking dudes out. They got a money punch in their arsenal. <clears throat> and Ryan Garcia definitely got a, a mean left hook on him. So that's going to be something that Devin can't disregard at no point a time in the fight. And if Derrick James uh, put out the right fight plan, and, and he worked with that right hand enough. It's going to be a lot of, it's going to be opportunities for Ryan Garcia just because Devin going to be so dead set on making sure he don't get hit with that left hook. Uh, so I think out of, the, out of the two, I would say Ryan got a better chance, in my opinion, than Frank do going up against Tank. Uh, that's going to be a motherfucker right there. But, you know, I am glad that Derrick James, that although he ain't with Earl no more, I hate that happen. But who only knows what really happened, but I always did like Derrick James. I mean, I just felt like he, 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 he uh, <clears throat> I felt like he let Earl down in that fight with Bud, because I, I just, it just looked like he didn't send him in that prepared for Terrence Crawford. It just seemed like he sent him in that fight. I didn't see, I just, I didn't see a fight specific Terrence Crawford fight plan, and I definitely didn't see one that would have had any uh, chance at working from the way Earl came out in the first couple of rounds. So I figured that come from him not spending enough time in that film because he trained all them fighters last year. And to my knowledge, 
he wasn't used to it. You know, uh, he only had Earl for the longest, and then he picked up Charlo, then he picked up Frank, and then now you got Ryan Garcia, AJ, and everybody got a, they all had a big fight at the same time. Uh, you need to be, either have a nice staff to help you, a nice team, or you definitely need to be, I feel like you need to be uh, experienced when you training that many dudes that's fighting on the level that these dudes fighting on. Uh, Cause you know, uh, can't, you can't make no mistakes here. And losing these big fights, man, look at Tim Zoo, you can fall back into that bitch out there, it's all over. But uh, you know, uh, glad to see Derek James still in the mix, but this, it, 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 this shit can go south real fast uh, if he lose in April and in June, which is more than likely what's going to happen. But uh, that's it for me on this video. If you like the video, like and subscribe. Till next time, it's your boy Spiel Dog. I'm out.